The year is AD 60 or 61, and this is Boudicca, who was queen of the Iceni's, and here she is in her little settlement in Norfolk. She was married to the chieftain, and then the chieftain died. Now tradition had it for the Celts who lived in England that she should inherit all the land. However, the Roman governor of the local area had decided to take it all himself. It's all mine, he said, and he went off. She was very cross and called her Celtic, uh, important men together from her tribe and different and said this is not good enough we must get rid of the Romans they should not be in our lands yeah yeah we agree we agree they said and so they went off to fight and she set off in her chariot with followed by all of her followers to attack the cities of Colchester and then London and St Albans this is them in London, raising it to the ground. And still today, archaeologists have found a thin layer of red soil, which suggests that it was indeed destroyed in around 60 or 61 AD. I don't know why I'm talking with this funny voice, but anyway. Uh, the Romans fled. They were terrified. Ah, ah, ah. And so the Celts continued on their terrible journey. The Roman governor of England, Gaius Suetonius Paulinus was not happy with this at all. He was not going to let uh, Boudicca get away with this. And so she, he called together his Romans. Oh, sorry. Uh, oh, he fell over. Called together his Romans. We must fight the Iceni and their followers. Yeah, yeah, happy to do that. Happy to do that. And so off they went. There was a big battle. A big battle between the Celts and the Romans, but the Romans, a formidable fighting machine, were stronger, and they destroyed the Celts. We won! We won! Boudicca, however, was left alive, and she had to then make a terrible decision. She could either allow herself to be captured by the Romans and be taken to Rome as a... As a as a tribute, as a captive, as something to show off the great Roman victory, or she could take poison and kill herself. And she decided to take poison and kill herself. And that is the sad uh, but courageous story of Boudicca trying to defeat the Romans, who ended up staying in England until the 400s. But that is another story. The end.